Hello everyone, it's me, Julie, and I'm back with another video. It's October, the end of the year is coming, but before that, we've got a load of other things to deal with. For instance, it's October now, like I said, and so it's Halloween. And I was looking on the Jelly Cat website. No, I wasn't. I saw an advert on Instagram about some new Halloween items that they've got. Now, I think last year, or perhaps a year before, I got this thing called a wrapper bat. I can't show you that now because it's at school where most of my Jelly Cats and stuff things end up uh, but I saw some items and I thought this will be a good one to get one because it can match for Halloween even though Halloween's in half term but two it will match with our ancient Egyptian topic that we do in the summer term so anyway um, I've already opened the box but inside and that's just my invoice inside I decided this time to go for they had gift boxes so I'm just going to take this out and show you the gift box that it came in. So I don't know if you're st I'm still going to get the bag inside because I do like the Jelly Cat like um, drawstring bag. I'm not sure if I'll get that this time, but I do have a gift box. And I don't know if this is an indication as to the size of this thing, but um, I would assume that they gave you a different size box depending on the item that you have. It still comes with the bag. And like I always do, I get myself a free gift note and that's changed it used to have blue on it so I'm quite happy that it looks like this now and this is what it says so that's that it still comes in the bag oh let's have a look inside the box it says with a jelly in your belly and a cat inside your hat enjoy some soft and silly fun with your brand new jelly cat now that's new. I do wish, I love the box and I think it's it's cost six pounds, but I mean, it's something to keep things in. I wish they had smaller boxes to match the size of the item one was purchasing. So I am glad that it still came in this bag and it's literally a mummy. And I think his name is Mummy Ben. This is Mummy Ben. I'm sure that's what it said on the... Um, sorry not ben bob mummy bob as you can see there i am mummy bob and it's quite flat in terms of how jelly cats are if i was to take down jack from there he's got more of a body shape but i think it's quite sweet that this is a little halloween mummy that will tie in very nicely when we do ancient egyptians in the summer term so um just have a little look at the stitching. It's a very nice feel. It's not exactly, it's not white. It's more like a cream, which is good. More like a bandage colour. Um, there's the face. It's got little black eyes, a smiley mouth. And like the impression of wrapped bandages and some extra stitches where there are crosses and such. So I don't think it can sit down because it's not really jointed in that way, but I just felt like getting something different, so I did. So this is Mummy Bob. <laughs> 